Every day, young children like him run the risk of being poisoned by swallowing medicine. Most packaging does not mitigate that risk. Pharmacists, too, believe that we need to put an end to this as soon as possible. As pharmacists, we support the use of child-safe packaging. All too often, children are admitted to the hospital suffering from poisoning from a medication overdose. The cause of unintentional medication overdoses in children is often that they take medicines not intended for them during a moment of inattention on the part of the parents. For example, you place your medication next to your breakfast plate, ready to be taken after eating. There's a moment of inattention. Perhaps you have to leave the table or the telephone rings, and your child takes the medication and eats it. The packaging system is actually the final line of defense against children unintentionally and undesirably taking I feel, we feel as pharmacists, that this fail-safe is insufficient. A child can easily get pills out of a strip, boxes are often very easy for children to open, and bottles are too, and their contents are quickly drunk. There are many rules with which the packaging of, for instance, detergents must comply. That's not the case for medicines, and in fact that's incomprehensible. To prevent young children from being poisoned by medicines, Echo Bliss presents an innovative packaging concept, Locked for Kids. Locked for Kids is the first child-resistant reclosable carton box that meets the strict EU and U.S. standards for reclosable child-safe packaging. It has been tested and certified by the Belgian Packaging Institute, BPI. At the Belgium Packaging Institute in Brussels, we maintain an ISO 17025 certified testing laboratory. Our certification allows us to test child-safe packaging. I will perform several tests at your premises. We work according to the international ISO standards, which are officially recognized at an international level. However, should you wish to export your product to the U.S., we will follow the U.S. protocol. Normally, we are required to test 50 children at five different locations. The tests are primarily held at schools, as these are familiar environments for children. Small groups are formed, each with a supervisor trained by the Belgium Packaging Institute. Initially, the groups are given five minutes to open the packaging. After this first test, we show them how to open the packaging without providing any further explanation. Next, the children are given another five minutes to try and get them open. The aim is that the children will not be able to do so, although a certain margin is permitted. Three out of fifty children are allowed to be able to open the packaging. Should a fourth child succeed in opening the packaging, then a new group of fifty children must be tested. If the tests proceed positively, the Belgium Packaging Institute will have a test report and test certificate issued so that the packaging may be brought onto the market as child safe. Legislation on poisonous and hazardous items is becoming stricter, so the industry must make the effort to produce and market more child safe packaging. Young children have difficulty opening locked for kids packaging. Of course, adults and the elderly do not. They are able to easily open and reclose the box. This is a wonderful invention. It's easy to use and safe for children. It should have been around years ago. It's easy to use and, more importantly, safe for our grandchildren. I really believe that children won't be able to open this packaging, and that makes me happy. Now is the time to take our responsibility. Locked for Kids enables you to prevent accidents with pharmaceutical products and protect the lives of young, vulnerable children. Get a hold on the new standard in child-resistant packaging.